In this video, we are looking at something you can do early on in the game to get a steady flow of consistent credits. Credits are very important in this game, and there's going to be multiple ways of getting credits and even ways of getting a lot of credits really fast. But early into the game, when you are brand new and running around, not really understanding what to do because there's so many things that are being thrown at you, there is one easy quest line repeatable mission that you can go and do to be able to get a steady flow of credits. So if this video is helpful and you enjoy it and you're going to use this, make sure you hit that like button. Leave me a comment down below. Tell me what you think about this game so far. Are you enjoying it? Is there anything you found that might be an even easier way to get some credits or some loot? Let me know in the comments. So once you reach New Atlantis, which is not far into the game whatsoever, it's where you meet Constellation. It's where the game really starts to begin. Before you continue through the main quest, you can run around the city. At this point, you'll be given activities and random things appearing and, you know, stuff to do. And it becomes very overwhelming. One thing that isn't obvious is the Gal Bank, right? So chances are you're at the residential district when you get to New Atlantis and you want to go to the commercial district. So find the little train boy and go flying across to the commercial district as you leave the train run straight ahead and on your left will be the gal bank when you enter here you're going to find an npc behind a desk called landry hewitt i think his name was but his name's landry and he will provide you with the ability to do bounty hunting you just go up to him you talk to him he gives you a target and he'll give you some advice like oh this person would rather not them be hurt or in other cases he'll be like you're probably going to have to fight and you can go and do these missions and the very first one you get is a very quick little jump to another system. Get the guy, talk to him or kill him. Get back. It's not even five minutes. Not even that. You get 2,000 credits right off the bat. You get introduced to like the persuasion mechanics as well because obviously you want to try and persuade them. And it looks as if there's four little bars in the bottom left when you're talking to the guy that you're trying to get the bounty from. And you have to do a bunch of options. So it'll give you like plus one, plus two, plus four. If you do plus four and it's successful, you will persuade them off the bat. If you do plus one, plus one, plus one, you're not going to persuade them because you need four and you've only done three. But the plus ones are more chance of being successful and that's why they're green. So the persuasion mechanic will obviously be backed up with your background and traits too. But it's a really interesting, fun little dialogue you can have with these missions. Once you've spoken to them, you can ransack them, ransack their house if you if you manage to beat them up like I did. But if you just talk to them and persuade them, you can get your credits back too and leave them alive. I don't know whether that will actually impact the game in a way where you might be able to go back to that person later and get an extra quest or something. But in my opinion, just best to beat them up and take what you're owed. Once you get that, you can just jump back to um, New Atlantis, run back to the commercial district, go to the bank and talk to them and get your rewards. The more you do, the more rewards you get, the harder, more challenging difficulties, the more credits you get in return. However, it's not that difficult in my opinion so far for me at least. Some of these bounties might be out of your jump range right near the start, but I haven't found one yet and I've done quite a few. And it's just an easy, nice, quick way to get some credits built up so that you can go about your business and do whatever you want to do in the city. And if you're not interested in going straight down the main quest line, this is a fun little side hustle you can do other than all the other things you'll find to do in New Atlantis. And that's it. Just a very quick and easy side hustle to do from the very start of the game. Something that you want to probably get involved in as well so that when you get later on in the game, you're fighting bigger, more challenging bounties, which are going to be very rewarding for the point in the game that you'll be at because you started at the same time when you started as a newbie, if that makes sense. You're going to progress the bounty hunting as you're progressing your character and the, and the world and everything you're going to experience. And I just think it's pretty cool. There's so much that I haven't found yet or seen yet. And I just randomly came across this guy at the bank and thought, oh, I'll try that. And the rewards were pretty damn good. So try it out. Let me know what you think down below. Hit the like button, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. I've been easy now. You guys have been awesome.